My name is Landry Herimbury, and I'm a graduate student here at the University of Maryland. I'm going to be presenting you um, how a Van de Graaff generator works. A Van de Graaff generator is made of two main parts, um, a sphere that charges up to a, a positive charge and uh, another sphere that's connected to ground. The belt inside the Van de Graaff generator rolls on two rollers, one in the dome and one in the base. As the belt moves over the rollers, a triboelectric effect between the different materials causes a positive electric charge to build up. The surplus positive charges accumulate on the outer surface of the generator's conductive dome. As the generator's dome builds up a positive charge, the ground sphere builds up a negative charge by induction. When the two spheres are brought close together, the negative charges on the ground sphere and the positive charges on the generator are attracted to each other. So now I have a question for all of you. Um, I'm going to put these pie plates onto the positively, positively charged um, sphere. My question is, what do you think is going to happen? Are they going to fly off? Is one of them going to fly off? Is nothing going to happen? So now let me show you what actually happens. The sphere of the Van Graaff generator charged up positively and also charged all the plates in the same, with the same positive charge. And since like charges uh, repel, um, pipe plates were pushing on each other. And one by one, the forces pushing the pipe plates apart were, became stronger than, the, than gravity, and they one by one flew off. Thanks for watching uh, this electrifying demonstration. <laughs>